Hello everyone, Sigma Later here. Welcome back to Final Fantasy 7. We need to get Wedge some help. I'm not holding out much hope for his survival. Since those uh, cloaked death eaters. I'm going to look around for the others. He made it, didn't he? They could still be alive. I saw them both at the pillar. Jesse and Biggs. Saw how bad they were hurt. I'm sorry, but... Don't. supposed to return to us. <sighs> but if we stop now, they'll never let us live it down. Damn. <sighs> Broken dreams. Yeah. Ain't that the truth? God, this game really tugs on the old heartstrings, doesn't it? Was it like this in the original? I've never played the original. I'm sorry. I truly am. We had no other place to go, and... I would never leave a wounded man out on the street. <sighs> Elmira, I know what you said, but you have to let us go after Aerith. Not this again. We found an underground Shinra lab, where they've done human testing. This wasn't the first time, and it won't be the last. I know these people, and I know they're never going to let Aerith go. She's the last living ancient on the planet. Think about what that means to Shinra scientists. Especially to that son of a bitch, Hojo. We're all just numbers and meat Enough! to him. But... <sighs> Please, I need some time to think. You've all had a long day. Why don't you go upstairs and get some rest? The hell? It's not letting me go in there. Maybe they went up here? Okay then. Maybe downstairs. I'm 
Looks like Marlene's asleep. You looking at? Ah, Tifa. Did I just completely miss you when I was on the third floor? Can't sleep? No. You too? I heard footsteps. Sorry, didn't mean to wake you. I'm a light sleeper. It's a soldier thing. <sighs> that flower you gave me the other night, that was from Aerith, wasn't it? Oh. <laughs> I knew there was something weird going on. You buying flowers? They symbolize reunion, believe it or not. I was curious, so I looked it up. I tried to keep it alive as long as I could. But now, it's dead and buried. <sighs> like the bar, our home, and everything else. Give her a hug, man, for goodness sake. They took everything from us. Again. Hug her, man, for God's sake. What's wrong with you? Yes, that a boy. I am all about Tifa. <laughs> Cloud. Cloud, you're hurting me. Hugged her too tight. It's not true. Thank you. Oh, you two are so cute together. You've done more for us than we deserve. I won't forget this. If you ever need anything, all you gotta do is holler. Happy to help out however I can. Elmira. I've been thinking about what you said. She's calling out to me. I can feel it. We all can. So please. She's our friend. We have to help her. I always knew it was coming. Knew that one day I'd have to say goodbye to my baby girl. But not yet. <clears throat> Please, bring her back to me. <clears throat> Daddy! Hmm? Marlene. Are you going? I wish I didn't have to. I 
I wish I could be with you all the time. I really do. But if I stay here, I can't fight out there. Some bad people are trying to hurt the planet. And Daddy, Daddy and his friends are trying to stop those bad people. The slums, your friends, the whole planet. It's Daddy's job to protect it. Hmm? That's why I've got to go. You remember that nice girl who came to find you? Well, now we have to go find her. And when we bring her home, you need to say thank you, okay? Yes. That girl, she was kind of... <sighs> what? Nothing. You should help her. We will. Oh, bless her. Don't you dare die as well, Barrett. Okay. You can go. <laughs> That's usually a warning. Whenever says whenever anytime somebody in any game, movie or whatever, anytime they promise they'll come back alive, that's like it's that's like signing your own death warrant. Get some payback. Don't forget why we're doing this. I know, I know. To rescue Aerith. Ooh, a new shiny thing. So, how are we supposed to get topside? With everything that's happened, the trains still aren't running. Well, we could walk along the Pedometer? What is that? Uh... May do something after taking a number of steps with it. Alright then. MP up. Refocus materia. Uh, yeah, I'll keep that on. Fire, lightning. Could probably get you a better thing. Cow's got the heavy duty. How much gill do I have? Can I actually afford any more? 5,000 gill. Oh no! I need to get Barrett's other weapon. Rex. The city's on high alert. All the roads and public transit have probably been locked down by now. So what's the plan then? You know another way up? No, but I think I know someone who might. You mean Corneo. Alright, so we have to go deal with Corneo again, huh? I'm sure he'll be delighted to see us after we uh, defeated his pet. I wonder if Chaddy's around here, actually. He might have some more uh, VR missions for us. Oh, hang on. Anyone I can talk to in here about Biggs? No, that teacher woman isn't here. Should probably check on the kids too, actually. Anything in here? Avalanche is to blame. But wait! 
Did you know Wu Tai is the one funding their activities? For all their claims about fighting for the slums, they're nothing more than pawns of Wu Tai, puppets dancing to the tune of their foreign masters. And that's the truth. Topside news delivered straight to your ears. That'll be five kill. Five kill. Come on. Damn, man. Knew we couldn't trust Wu Tai to leave us alone. It's the reactors. They want them, we got them. Does this mean there will be another war? After what they've done, what choice do we have? Five gill apiece, cough it up. The truth ain't free, you know. <sighs> we ain't no damn pawns of Wu Tai. I couldn't care less about the rest, but that shit. <clears throat> <clears throat> no one will listen to us. There's no point in even trying. I'm sorry. Hey. Hey, Tifa, listen. There's no room in this for regrets or what-ifs or any of that. All we can do is keep moving forward, keep following this path we chose. Wherever, so we can say we did all we could. I know. But right now, instead of looking forward, you need to look around. Everyone here is terrified. So I'm asking you, don't. Shit. Odd jobs, the final job. The collapse of the plate means that many people in the slums are in desperate need of assistance. Once the party enters the Shinra building, they will no longer be able to help anyone in need. Therefore, to try to, try to help as many people as possible before entering Shinra HQ. Okay. We're short on time, but let's try to help out we can. Did a plate really fall? Right, weapons. You don't have uh, the thing. No. All right then. The world's just too dangerous these days not to keep a weapon at your side. Oh, there she is. How far could they have gone? Oh, Cloud, have you seen the kids around by any chance? I haven't seen them since they left to do their patrols. I knew I should have told them to stay inside today. If you do happen to run into them somewhere, could you tell them to come back right away? I can describe them if it'd help. Don't worry, I'll know. Just stay calm and wait here. You never know, they might come back on their own. Okay? Yes, of course. Thank you so very much. All right. I'll try to find the kids. Oh, wait. Can I get back to that church? There was material at the church. Oh, hello, you. you Cloud, right? Man, am I glad I caught you. Sam, he told me who you are. Said you're a merc and a former soldier at that. Listen, I hate to ask, but you got a few runaway birds. Mind helping us find them? Poor things were so startled by that plate coming down, they just up and bolted. I'm sure they're around here somewhere, frightened and hungry. <sighs> My poor birds. Worried about them, huh? Alright, I think we can help you out. Oh, thank you. When you find them, feed them this. There's three missing all told, and their names are Coco, Lolo, and Momo. They'll come on home once they got some food in their bellies. Good luck. I'm counting on y'all. Chocobo carriages will take you to destinations much faster than by foot. Finding the missing Chocobos for Sam increases the number of available destinations. To take a ride, check the schedule at a Chocobo station, and talk to the staff. Oh, cool, got a quick travel element. Nice. Collect expressway, sector five, under city entrance. Okay. Oh, we've got no you again. I'll talk to you later. Let's see if we can find these 
chocobos and these and the kids. So if I find these birds, I can get to all these other areas quicker. I appreciate that idea. Okay. What's that? Oh, it's one of the kids. Lost? Who said we were lost? Stupid old man. What'd you say? What are you doing out here? And where's everyone else? Well, we saw a bunch of tombstones lying on the ground, so we decided to stand them back up. And then I heard laughing coming from somewhere, and when I turned around, everyone was gone. I was alone. Oh, good. Ghosties. Got a cess. Susceptible to fire, cool. Regen fully restore HP over time.
Damn it! Stop disappearing when I do that! There we go. And thankfully there's a blue bench here so I can just use that to heal back up. And all the kids are back. Guys. Oh. Look, Cloud's here too. So why'd you kids come out all this way? This is where our parents are. They're resting, but we wanted to say hi. Sometimes you just want to do that, you know? I do. Thanks so much for coming to find us. That's another one I owe you. We're gonna head back to the house now. Miss Foley is probably pretty worried. Hey, Cloud, I found this on the ground. We should take it. I think it might come in handy. Time material. Little smart asses. <laughs> <laughs> With good hearts. Oh, I'm already healed back up. Alright, so that's the kids found. What's this time materia? Time. Allows you to use time magic. Okay. Oh, does that mean I can like slow enemies down? Or speed myself up, maybe? What about upgrades? Ooh. Barrett could use some upgrading, so let's get let's get him up to uh, speed. New material slot. Yes, that's handy. We'll upgrade his other weapon as well. What we've we got left, what we've we got available in here: defense and attack. Go. Uh, Aerith, I'll upgrade later. Let's go back to the materia. No. Oh, was that one I get? I gave another slot to. Was it? All right. When at the end of the day all is said and done, let's go. For, let's see if we can find these chocobos. I'm, I'm assuming they're around this this area. Excuse me. Yes, there's one. Oh, hello. Deal with that. Yes, I need you to assess. Let's make it. 
Credence is unknown. Spell weaving airborne lizards found in the Sector 5 slums. Inquisitive by nature, they cannot resist collecting shiny objects such as jewellery. While enveloped in darkness, they absorb all spells, however, inflicting a certain amount of damage. Right, so. It's got to be physical attacks, has it? You're fine, we found you. Have one of those. Okay, so we've unlocked those areas. I, I like this ability that Barrett has. That's used up all of his MP, so we'll use the turbo ether on him. Because that's going to be useful. And also, anything around here I could smash? No. Alright. I think he said there were three. So that's one down. Nope, still can't get in there yet. Okay, missed. Anything over there? No. Oh, hello. Anything here? No. Alright. Worth checking every corner, every nook and cranny. Did it say which chocobo we actually saved, or was that just, like, not important? I should pay more attention to what's going on around me. Walked 1,000 out of 5,000 steps. Okay. 
wonder if it's going to be worth it, whatever this pedometer material is for. Okay, got some these things to fight. Cheers. Ah, okay. We're back here. Yeah, Moogle Medal. Have to go back to the Moogle Emporium and see what I can get with some of these medals. He wasn't dead. I'm sure you would, Tifa. I'm sure you would. Anything down here? No. I found one chocobo. Where are the other two? goes back there. Bring it. Here we go. See ya. It's over. Go. Damn hedgehog pies. That's what they were, weren't they? Ah, now we're back here. What were you thinking? Stupid, stupid, stupid. Oh, it's a holy die. Oh, look who it is. Where'd he go? Oh, Johnny's been hacked. Bro, Tifa! Damn, is it good to see you guys again? I told you to stop calling me that. Bro, I'm in serious need of your expertise. Lend me a hand. Fine. What? Truth is, I'm uh, trying to get out of town for uh, reasons. Yeah, reasons. But the thing is, <laughs> I got mugged. She took it. Took it all, man. <sighs> I tried to chase her down. I really did. But she was real fast like. Man, what am I gonna do? This could be the end for old Johnny boy. I'm begging you, help me out. Come on, bro. What'd she look like? Bro. Uh, hold on. Let me think. I wanna get this right. She was a cutie, black hair. Pretty sure she was wearing a hat. And, uh, oh yeah, she was wearing these striped stockings too. Curie? 
Which way did she go? Uh, toward the church, I think. By coincidence, I was heading in that general direction. Hey there, are you alone? I uh, can't talk to those people. Ah, uh, here we go. Anything interesting for us? No. Alright. Okay, no one's talking up there. Ooh, 500 gil, thank you. Oh, look who it is. Maybe I'll find the other chocobos in this direction. Or maybe they're spread out across other areas. And that one I found was just uh, lucky. Again, I keep calling him Garrett for some reason. They're nothing. Here, <laughs> wink, wink, nudge, nudge. All right, nothing else around here. No chocobo, chocobo. Hey, buddy. There you go. <laughs> Excellent. I like it. I'm liking how all these side quests are sort of rolling on top of each other. I start out by looking for some kids. I find a chocobo as a result. Now I'm hunting down a thief. Find another chocobo as a result. What are you doing here? Oh, it's you, my good Merc. What brilliant timing you have. Oh, hello there. It is a pleasure to meet you both. I'm a journalist for The Daily Buzz. The Daily Buzz? You mean that trash filled with Shinra fluff pieces? Well, yes, that's fair. But we do get a lot of inside information because of our close ties with the company. <laughs> Curious? Here's the scoop. A certain division of Shinra, that shall remain nameless, was planning to seize Corneo's assets. But before they could, the key to his secret vault within which his misbegotten gains were securely tucked away was ah. stolen. And my sources tell me that the thief is the Undercity's beloved hero, the Angel of the Slums. Is it the unidentified Kyrie? who's been targeting anyone with ties to Shinra or Corneo? Yes, that Angel of the Slums has struck again. Well, do I have your undivided attention now? Kinda, but hurry it up. We don't have time for a three-act play. Then I'll make this quick. So, my good Merc, you do remember where the Angel's hideout is, right? Do you remember the death threat she left there? Oh, that. I've decided to seek the silver lining in this case. 
If the angel of the slums deigns to take an interest in a humble reporter, then that itself would be a story. What are you asking? If you recover the stolen key, feel free to help yourself to the contents of Corneille's vault. All I want is knowledge, the identity of the angel. So if you happen to learn anything of value, I'd be tremendously grateful to you if you passed it along. It is Carrier, isn't it? Ooh, what's this shiny blue thing? Can I pick it up before talking to her? Apparently I can. Medicinal flowers obtained. What? It wasn't me. You've got the wrong girl. Never committed a crime in my life. You Kyrie? Uh, Kyrie? Who's that? Can't say I know her, but cool name. <laughs> Someone mugged our friend and took every last skill he had. Sound familiar? Oh, that? <laughs> oh, I thought it was an actual trouble. Don't scare me like that. Now I remember you. You're that chick. The one who was spreading lies in Sector 5. Oh yeah, I did do that. <laughs> good times, good times. <gasps> Hold on. I know you, Blondie. You're that merc everyone's talking about. Oh, maybe my luck's not so bad. Shinra's after me. You've got to help me. So from them too, did you? No. Well, yes, sort of. It's complicated. How was I supposed to know they were Shinra? And now those jerks won't leave me alone. Even though all I took was some ugly key. I mean, what's the big deal anyway? Wait a minute. That was you? <sighs> oh, great. So everyone's talking about it? Is this the end? Am I a dead woman? Do I have to go on the run? Leave Midgar forever and, and never look back? Nice performance. Kyrie, please, just give us the money you stole from our friend, would you? And the key while you're at it. No way! You're gonna split the second I do! We'll handle Shinra if you give us the key. Deal? It's a deal. Right about now, those Shinra creeps should be hanging out at the Coliseum. They're waiting for a special match to start, starring yours truly. It's the talk of the town. You're joking. Oh, I won't be there. I'm not stupid. It's a miracle you've managed to stay alive this long. I'll take that as a compliment. Now run along and clean up my mess. <sighs> You'll get your key once I know I'm safe. But you're going to split as soon as we do. Chakra materia. Really? What do you got that one? Don't believe there's anything else in here, is there? Quick nosy. Now, this is where the chakra bit was, and I can't get back upstairs, so yeah. a desire that transcends the professional could it be love okay so he's crazy all right so i need to get to the coliseum three hundred gil yeah it's not too bad and we'll see if we can find the last chocobo while we're at it. <coughs> Quite 
Happy little tune. In your own time game. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank goodness. Been looking for y'all. You gotta help me. It's the Chocobos. They'd escape, wouldn't you know? Yeah. I know, I've still got to find one more. Do we really have to deal with Corneo again? Got no other choice. What? Did you guys get into it with him or something? I don't want to talk about it. Huh? Hey, Cloud! What happened? Don't recall. Everyone's so sad. Oh, hey, yeah. Betty. I'm so glad to see you're okay. You too. Uh, where's Marlene? Is she okay? Don't worry. She's safe. Really? I'm so glad. Hey, can you help me with something? I'm looking for music discs for the jukebox. I think some new music might cheer people up. Make them happy. That's a wonderful idea. Okay. If we find any music discs, we'll bring them straight to you. You just uh, so it's probably going to be worth my time checking all the other areas for side missions before doing the main one. Okay, I've got a good collection so far. Oh, hello, who are you? Everything gone, just like that. Alright, so your mission isn't ready yet, I gather. Oh! A b bottle of celery or something. I'm not really sure what that's for, but we'll find out. Chadley said, yeah, there he is. Hey, Chadley boy. Hey, those officers, where'd they go? I hope you will continue to help me gather vital information for my research. Of course. Do you have anything new for me? No. Ooh, what's this? Alright, I'll get one of those and one of those, as I don't own them. Auto cure. Alright. Item, yep. Yeah. I'll have one of everything on the menu. Or did I sell these and they've just rebought them for no reason? No idea. I look forward to receiving all of your future battle intel submissions. Hey, those officers, where'd they go? Who knows, my friend? <coughs> Excuse me. So we've got the power of music, Chocobo Dude, and the Tomboy Bandit. The Coliseum is open for business and hungry for fresh I really don't want you. Are you kidding me? With these babies, you can send intruders flying. I guarantee this is the only home protection you'll ever need. Sure. What do you have? Yeah, I'll have that. Fuzzy Wuzzy was a bear. And Mr. Cuddlesworth. No, I don't think I will. Only a few left. Get yours while you can. Alright, as we're here. We'll go down here. And then have a look around town for any other side missions. You weren't here last time, were you, Barrett? I probably should have listened to that conversation you were having before. Right. Cool. That's all sorted. Shouldn't need to look in there. 
Excuse me. Anything in here? No. Alrighty. Oh, champ! Couldn't have picked a better time. This Kyrie chick totally flaked on her match, which means we're down a fighter, and we can't exactly pit the other guy against himself. What do you say? Mind taking her spot? Sure. I'll take it. Sweet! You're a real wall market hero, man. Crowd's gonna go wild when they see you. Oh, I'm probably gonna lose this first one. That's usually how it goes, but it'll it'll end off this episode nicely if I win. The fuck is that? Oh, it's this dude again. Where's the girl, Kyrie? That thieving little pipsqueak. Guess who he's the guy she's running from. Kyrie's not coming. He'll have to make do with us. <laughs> Whatever. I can roll with it. After all, you and me, we got unfinished business. In a shocking turn of events, our next bout is now a grudge match. <laughs> Which of these two will claim victory in today's Angel Cup? What is that thing? Fighters, begin! Take the lead. Right, assess the Hellhound. Weakness Ice. A species that is pr uh, the product of a particularly deranged series of experiments, these two headed creatures have limbs and tails that ignite when provoked. Savage and ravenous, they leave nothing behind after catching their prey, not even bones. Yes, staggered. Uh, abilities. Yes. 
Buzz off. Yes. Not only does he retain his crown, but now he can add Beast Whisperer to his list of impressive achievements. Whatever that means. That wasn't too much trouble. Hey there. Watching you guys fight gave me goosebumps. Hope your next match is even better than the last. Yeah, we'll return to carry eight. <coughs> Because I can always come back. I can use the Chugaboo system now. But I want that key. I should hope for... She hasn't skipped town. Like a b -b bitch No, she hasn't. So how'd it go? Well enough. If they're smart, they won't send anyone else. Really? Oh, that is so good to hear. Learn your lesson, girl. Totally. From now on, I only steal from the right people. <laughs> ain't the lesson. <sighs> Talk about a weight off my shoulders. Oh, I completely lost track of time. I'd better get going. Hold it. Uh, Grandma! Why are you here? You, young lady, are going to hear about this later. Thank you for keeping her out of trouble. She said Grandma? What? Did I forget to mention it to you? Kyrie is my granddaughter, my flesh and blood. See, we even have the same eyes. Kyrie, the key. You've kept them waiting long enough. Yeah, yeah. What's it for, anyway? Why do you guys want it? And how's that any of your business, young lady? Learn to wipe your own ass before you start rooting around in other people's shit. <laughs> Grandma, <laughs> Me embarrass you. Oh, the girl Miria, you, you are awesome. A thief needs principles, not to mention the courage of convictions to follow their conscience. Take it from me, the guardian angel of the slums. Wait a minute, you're the angel, and you three are avalanche. <sighs> There's a fire in you, I can see it flickering in your eyes. That same fire's in me, too. The guardian angel of the slums, avalanche. They're just names. We are who we choose to be. But you have to decide who that is and commit. Make the most of your time when you still have it. Wise words. <laughs> Excellent. Well, can end this episode on a, on a happier note. I can now check out those sealed places with the uh, now I've got the key for because I think there was another one, wasn't there? In like the sewers. So I've got a couple of special areas to check out. But for now I'm going to end this episode here. Thank you very much for taking the time to watch this guys. If you liked it like, subscribe, ding that bell. I've been Sigma Later. This has been Final Fantasy 7 and I'll catch you next time. Take care now. <laughs>